boys and whammon if you were whammon that's okay anyway today uh you guys commented and said we should do the what's in my mouth challenge and someone else said uh we should do a three course meal with main ingredient mustard we're gonna be doing both of those today but before we do anything, we need hand hygiene. Hand hygiene. Hand hygiene. Not too little or too much. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so this is round one. Uh, for round one, I'm going to be cooking the foods, but I don't know what those foods are. See what I'm saying? Because Caden picked the foods, Mr. Mm -hmm. Caden Man. Okay, round one, what's in my mouth food edition. Let's start. Okay, good. Go put your blindfold on, mister. Bye. Okay, are you ready, Tristan? Yeah! Okay, the first one, let me just try to scoop it out. It's kind of hard. Okay. Mm, is it gross? Okay. Now, let me just open your horse face here. Okay. Mm. Try to guess what it is. May uh, mayonnaise. Mm. It's pretty good. Okay, I'm just not even, I don't even need this one. So, just put it back in there. Just, okay. Okay. What is it? Oh. No, I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Oh, more. Ah. There we go. Okay. I got it. Okay. Okay. Um. Let's see. That is. Um. Those things our mom cooked with green onions. Use that to get off. Okay. Green onions. It's yeah. Pretty close. Kind of tastes like chives, but. Now this one. Don't inhale this one. Oh crap. No okay. Did you get it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Paprika. I already know that oh. one. Okay then. Paprika. Ah. Ah. Okay, Tristan, take off your blindfold horse face thing. Okay, now you're not gonna be able to see what's from this, so see that? Lift that up. That's what you're going to be using. Ooh, Mi Miracle Whip, paprika, and chives. We didn't have any chives. Green, so. things, chives. And we're going to be using mustard too. French's classic yellow mustard. Okay, now try to guess what you're cooking now. Uh, let's see. I have no clue. Maybe we're going to be cooking a dolphin. That's not legal. No. We, you are gonna be cooking deviled eggs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's gonna be fun. And you better make them good too. I will. Okay, so the first step for making deviled eggs is you mix the eggs. You mix them for five minutes. Do not stop until you get five minutes. Okay, so some of my uh, go-to ingredients for deviled eggs. One of them is French's yellow mustard. Never forget about that. Need some of that. My, I'll, I'll, save, I'll save this one for last because this is a special one. Uh, some sea salt, just a little bit of that. Pepper. Uh, t timely, t finely, whatever they are. Uh, you put that in there too. I cannot find the open. Oh, there it is. Those, those are, these are great. Uh, some of these. R rosemary leaves. Want some of those? Ugh, I, I kind of put a lot. That's okay. Uh, celery salt. That's always nice. Let's put. <laughs> That's okay. I didn't think it was gonna come out that fast. Garlic salt. That's quite a bit too. You know that's also okay. I put that much in it anyway. Parcel flakes, this is okay. You, you can put a lot in here if you want. I'm not going to. Well, actually, I am. There we go. Basil leaves, those are always great in your devil legs. And last but not least, paprika, the stuff I ate. This is one of the main ingredients. So just top that off. Some more yellow mustard. Don't mind that though. This is gonna be great. Okay, also, what you wanna do is mix all of this together for another five minutes, just like what you did with the eggs.
one pair of pants later. Okay, so once they're done boiling, all you gotta do is uh, put your French's classic yellow mustard in there to marinate or whatnot. That's always good. Ooh, it looks like string cheese. Don't forget to mix this for another five minutes to let it marinate even more. This is always good. Okay, for this portion of it, uh, you take your eggs and you gotta deshell them. I'm gonna deshell this one real quick. Okay, so now that we got this, uh, I, by the way, I was a little bit hungry before we started. Uh, I ate a little bit. That's okay. Uh, cut right down the middle. So this is the middle. Right there. It's perfect. Now we take these yolks, we extract them. I mix it. Try and get it all the way around in there. So uh, I don't know where they went, but that's always okay. Mix it up, mix it up, mix it up. Okay, so now that you got mixed, you slap this on on top. Slap it there. Second egg, you always gotta slap that. And after you do this, step, after you do this step, uh, what you're supposed to do is mi uh, not microwave it. You refrigerate it for one whole hour. One hour later. Okay, it's been one hour when I refrigerated them. Uh, now it's time to taste test. Caden, get in here. What is up, man? These are the eggs I made. My perfect eggs, as you can see, they're great. Wow, I don't know, even know how After you did this. After all those steps. I don't even know how you did this. I, I don't even think I can do this. Okay, let's get to taste test them. Okay. Just like, them up, do you yeah. pick up like the whole thing like tomatoes? You, you can do that if you want. Those like, are just like the tomatoes. two things or something. Like tomatoes good. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Classic. Oh, really? As you can see, I use the mustard. Yeah. Ooh. Those are the best devil eggs I've ever tasted. Mmm. They're simply delicious. Okay, so round two. Now, round two consists of, uh, it's pretty much the exact same thing I did, but it's switched around. Kane's gonna be cooking the things, the main course. I'm and master chef. He still doesn't know what it is because I picked it for him. He's going to be taste testing by what's in my mouth challenge. I'm going to feed him some stuff through the horse head. So that, that's about it, I guess. Let's get started. I'll go to my blindfold. Okay, so I'm going to grab this stuff. Like that. Okay, so now I'm going to grab a little thingy of that. It's hard to see anything. Put it in Jill's mouths. Okay. Did you get it? Mm -hmm. I do not like what that is. No. Okay, taste uh what is it what what do you think it is? I have no idea. You have no idea? Not whatsoever. Not like at all? garlic maybe? I don't know. Okay. Oh, I don't know that egg. What is it? Cheese. I'm just gonna Take that off. It is some really good cheese. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this because I can't tell you yet. Taste it. What do you think that is? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have no idea. It's spicy. Yep. It's really spicy. I'm not sure. Okay. Whatsoever. Like some weird hot sauce stuff, I guess. I don't know. Okay, anyway. Okay, so what you just ate was horseradish. That was the Ooh. spicy stuff. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought it was. Uh, but that garlic, the, the cheese. The risk, oh. the, this, this is the cheese. Cheese, yeah. cheese. There's the cheese. Um, do you know what your uh, main course is going to be? Um, just take a random wild guess. I have no idea. It's like it's a burger or something. Yeah. Um. I don't know. No, it is gonna be pasta and chicken. And you have to use cheese, garlic, and horseradish. I don't remember ever using horseradish. Well, um, you're gonna have to. Okay. Okay, now let's get started. Now first we're gonna use this cooking wine. Just gonna pour some of that right in there. 
And then after that, we are going to use the salt. I love salt. It's like really good. After that, you're you're gonna use this other wine, red wine vinegar. Okay, it's good. Okay, now we are gonna also use this olive oil because you know. Why would you ever cook without olive oil? Just use a lot of it because you want a lot of olive oil. It is necessary. Now after that, you need to use whatever this is. I don't even know, but you gotta add it because it's necessary for a good meal. Now after this, we're gonna use some gelatin. We need gelatin to like, you know, get like it crusty, you know, chicken, we want it really good. Okay, now we want to use these basil leaves because just, just for fun. Okay, now we want to use this popcorn seasoning. It has to be the white cheddar because if it's not the white cheddar, then you might as well not even cook. It's not coming out very well. Okay. We want baking powder. Just a little tiny dab of that. There you go. Okay, now we want this cheese. We just put the cheese in there. We also want this. We want the garlic. And we want the horseradish. Okay. Now after that, I'm going to take my glove off. I almost forgot. One more thing. Need some sugar. There we go. Okay, now we're just gonna mix this up. Okay, now we want the chicken. Just put it in there. Now this is the best part. This is the best part of the whole thing. Just there we go. And after we do that, we just want to like use our hands, like mix it up in there. We want the chicken to taste like mustard. We don't even want. We just want to know that we're eating like mustard. But like it will have the texture of chicken. Okay, now I'm gonna put it in here. And there we go. Now we just let it sit for a little bit, like five minutes about. Okay, now all we gotta do is turn the pressure cooker on and let it cook for about three days. Okay, we are done. It has been about three days. For some reason, I'm still wearing the same clothes. I don't know why, but let's call my brother. Tristan, come on. What's good? What is good, man? What's up? What's, what you want? So, Ooh. This is what I came up with. This is not too bad. It's not too bad. Um, so yeah, grab, I got the cheese, got the garlic. Got grab the a spoon because chicken. This is a great spoon, as you can see. Amazing. Okay. Now I don't even know where to start. Take a Just... quick bite. Oh yeah. Ooh, look at this. Zoom up on that. Look at how good that looks. Mm -hmm. That is real good. Oh, I got, got a good okay. chicken. Mm. Mm. That is just. That is amazing. That is the best thing I've ever had. Mm. Good job. Thank you. We are back, and right now we are going to do dessert. This is our last, and we are going to use mustard. French is a classic yellow mustard because if it's like Heinz or something, don't 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 do it. use it. Okay. Now first we pour in all this. Let me just mix, 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 mix her up. Ooh, stuffed crust. Stuffed crust. I'll stuff okay. you all in the crust. How do we put all this in? Yep. Okay. All of it. Just, there you go. just like the salt. Just like the salt. Okay, we're still mixing this. Uh Pat it down. Okay, now always Oops. pour the French's mustard in the whatever this concoction is. What is it? Pie crust or cheesecake? Oh yeah, cheesecake. Whatever it is. It's a good amount. Just mm -hmm. mix it up. Okay. Okay. Now for the next step. Okay. okay now just, just pour, pour the, the milk in. in. Yep. Perfect. Okay, That's now this great. is going to be a homemade cheesecake. Um, we made every wait, I thought it was, I thought it was Okay. Homemade cheesecake. Homemade cheesecake. Here we go. Oh, I've got to put the mustard in. Oh, yeah. It's already looking great. 
You're looking good, guys. Looking good, my homies. <laughs> You're helping me? Yeah. Oh, you gotta hold that fork. Mm, just yeah, I gotta spread it. it all around town. All around town. Spread <laughs> your... <laughs> okay. <laughs> For, it looks like like complete mustard. I know we just poured a little bit, but it looks a lot like only mustard. Very chunky. Oh yeah, just get that access. Get the access. Time to put it in the fridge. Yep, time to put it in the fridge right after. Just spread this out. Okay, so. This is our uh, mustard cheesecake. It's gonna taste great. We're done with the cheesecake, so it's, this is just the taste test. Mm. That is delicious. delicious. That is delicious. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Tastes like mustard. Mm -hmm. That's the end of the video, boys and women. If you were women, um, like this video and comment what we should do for our next video. Uh, subscribe if you already haven't, but you should have. Because you're watching this video. And our link to our channel subscription will be at the end of the video. But, I mean, this is the end of the video. Yeah, but like, but that's okay. the outro, though. Oh, the outro. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need that outro. Mm -hmm. Peace!